my name's Ronald, and it's time once again for my list of anime available for streaming legally on the internet. And it's a very exciting time, because it is time for the fall season of anime over in Japan, just started a few weeks ago, which means, of course, that Crunchyroll is, as usual, simulcasting a number of shows, including Fortune Arterial, The World God Only Knows, which is about a dating sim addict, Sora no Otoshimono Forte, which is about breasts, Otome Yokai Zakuro, Super Robot Wars OG The Inspector, which is about giant robots, Tante Opera Milky Homes, which is about lolis, Yumeiro Patissiere Professional, which is about, well, patissiere patissiere things, and Squid Girl, about cute moe girls, essentially. Meanwhile, over on Funimation.com, they've begun posting Girls Bravo, Seki Rei, Shakugan no Shana, a bit of a surprise there, considering that Shana is very, very popular in Japan, but not so much over here. So some of that is available now, as is Birdie the Mighty Decode, a bit of a uh, superpower type show, and Magic Kano. AnimeNewsNetwork.com has been uh, adding quite a few things, including Tokyo Majin, Trigun, ooh, Oedo Rocket, a very strange anime, The Wallflower, Eden of the East, excellent show if you get a chance, Kashun Sins, and Hitalia. should also mention that Vampire Knight over there is available but will be expiring soon. So if you want it, go watch it, as well as various episodes of One Piece. So catch them now. Finally, a bit of a recommendation, Hitamari Sketch, both the original show and X365, is available streaming on AnimeNetwork.com. And that's a lovely little slice of life show about a group of girls at what's essentially an art college. And it's a fun little light show about uh, just slice of life, normal student things. So it's a fun little thing and very artistically interesting. So, that's all the anime fit to talk about this week, and until a few weeks from now, when I'll be coming back with more things, uh, toodles!